Hi, kids. I'm Max Brooks, and you've got protection from zombies. We all know that at some point in our lives, we're going to be attacked by zombies. Now, the good news is, everything you'll need in your zombie survival kit, you should already have in your conventional disaster preparedness kit. First thing you're going to need is a small first aid kit, because even though nothing will save you from a zombie bite, you'll feel pretty dumb if you die from gangrene. Something else you should have is a crank-powered flashlight, preferably with a radio, because in times of national disasters, you need to know that your government will not rest until it's protected you from Planned Parenthood. Some form of dehydrated food, such as this MRE. It tastes like crap, but it will keep you going. It's never a bad idea to carry a few chemical light sticks with you, but don't try throwing them to distract zombies. They're walking corpses, not cocker spaniels. One of the most important things you'll need is a good solid crowbar. Because if you're ever trapped in a house that's been hit by an earthquake, you can use it to pry open a jammed door. And if you're also in a house that's been surrounded by zombies, you can use it to bash open their heads. Sleep tight, kids. <laughs>